Okay, I welcome you all. The problem reads allocate the center mass of uh, x bar over the straight road if its mass per unit length is given by the equation given. This is the mass per unit length, right? So this problem is coming from the engineering mechanics and statics of 13th edition by RC Bella. So our x bar this is just equal to integral x squared dm integral dm. Okay. All right. So let's start working. So let's say we have our small infinitesimal part there. And then we get, of course, let's say this is a, uh, it has a, uh, uh, thickness dx. And then we get, um, this part there, like so. dx this is x squared this is just equal to x all right and then what do we have dm here dm okay is equal to we are saying this is the mass per unit length right so it's mass per unit length okay so our dm therefore is just going to be equal to this mass the unit length dx okay this mass the unit length times dx so this smaller dm this is a smaller dm okay so you can think of this as our dm this is our dm so you can think of this as our dm so is dm itself is equal to m times dx okay then we have this smaller dm okay right so um, let's start the work so x bar therefore is equal to integral from 0 to l x squared dm then we are dividing this integral 0 to l dm then we know that our x squared is just x and our dm we said this is equal to um this is equal to m okay so let me just write this so this just becomes x squared uh, m dx okay this is just m dx all right therefore our x bar uh, this just becomes 0 to l uh, x our m we know already what m is is um, m 1 plus x squared divided by l squared we close this then we have dx then we are dividing this by integral 0 to L um, M 1 plus x squared okay dx like so right we can factor out uh, the m's so um, we have m can factor out m so this just becomes m like so and then um, we have x to the power 2 divided by 2 all right let me just move in steps so that i don't confuse anyone no one so this just becomes x plus x to the third divided by l squared like so 
uh, L, L, L squared, DX, okay, and also there we have M, 0 to L, 1 plus X squared, L squared, like so. Okay, therefore our X bar, uh, our X bar, our X bar, this is just equal to, our X bar, this is equal to, of course, this cancels out. Then this just becomes x squared divided by 2 plus x to the power 4 divided by 4l squared. Um, okay. And then we do have this. We are evaluating this from 0 to l. And then we divide this by uh, x plus x to the power 3 divided by 3l squared. Okay, so if we did so, then we'll have l squared divided by 2 plus uh, uh, l to the power 4 divided by 4 L square and this divided by L plus plus L to the power 3 divided by 3 L square so if we simplify this uh, this just becomes L squared divided by 2 plus L squared divided by 4 divided by L plus uh, L divided by 3. Therefore, X bar just becomes equal to, um, what do we have? So we have half, um, we have 0 0.5 plus 0 0.25, okay, divided by 1 plus 1 over 3. Okay, so this just becomes a 0 0.56, uh, 25, uh, L. Okay, that's 0.5 plus 0.25. Okay, 1 plus, like so, 5625. I think this is really about it. Uh, this is really about it. I hope this particular video was helpful. And if it was, uh, give me a thumbs up. I like your video. Continue subscribing and sharing my channel. Bye bye. And I'll see you in my next uh, screencast.